So this is a quick look at how to scan something on the new MFPs, the Ricoh MPC3000 ones. So when you come to the screen, it will look like this, ready for photocopying. What we want to do is change it to be ready to scan. And to do that, simply go over to here and hit the scan button changes the screen to here and that's not actually it it's this one the scan button here we go so then it uh, gives you some options scan to come on focus scan to email or scan to folder email is the most useful and all you need to do is uh, if your name is up here as one of the recent ones, you can click it. So I could click Kevin Smith and it lists his email address. And then I would put the elements that I need to scan up in the sorter. Slide it in, make sure it's all in nicely. And then very simply come back to the control panel, check you've got the right person, and then click the button. Boop. Off it goes. If the person you need to scan to is not listed, then you need to make a manual entry. And the button there is titled Manual Entry. Click it. You get the keyboard. You type in your name. Once it's all good, you've checked that's right, click OK. And then make sure the paper's in the sorter, nice and neat. Go to the start button. It scans through. Done. Nothing more to it. Then if you want to be very courteous, you could click back on the copying to return to the copying page. And that is scanning to your email in 2 minutes and 42 seconds. Once you uh, get back to your email, here you'll find it in your inbox. I've sent a few. It comes with this MFP support message and a big long number that uh, relates not very clearly to anything. But that's where it is. It will be saved as an attachment that you can simply double click to open and see what it was you scanned. So that's as simple as it is to send a scanned document to your email.